Ask the Experts, brought to you by Pelagic, high-performance offshore gear. On this episode, we address a great question from one of our fans, Phil Dawson from Sarasota, Florida. Phil asks, do you guys use aftermarket bait scents and additives when fishing offshore? Available in oils, gels, brines, and powders, aftermarket bait scents are designed to enhance the appeal of both natural and artificial bait and can be used across a wide range of venues. Gels and oils are available in countless flavors ranging from herring and tuna to crab and shrimp. Freshwater anglers across the country have been taking advantage of bait scents for decades. However, only in the last few years have saltwater fishermen really started to reap the same rewards. In the shallows, I regularly add Procure shrimp or mullet flavored gel to my soft plastics and swimming plugs, and while I've certainly caught plenty of fish without it, I've noticed a measurable difference in my catch ratio. Trout and redfish strike enhanced baits more aggressively and more often. Fish also tend to come back for a second swipe if they miss the lure the first time. When fishing structure, I also add flavor gel to my vertical jigs and have noticed the difference there as well. Phil, it seems that big amberjack can't stay off these things. In the deep, water-soluble fish oils, which totally dissolve and penetrate the water column, are the latest trend and are regularly used to enhance chump slicks by those seeking smoker king mackerel, hungry bottom fish, and of course, savage sharks. It's a proven fact that fish oils are detected by a predator's olfactory receptors, so why not take advantage of the added appeal? Phil, the bottom line is that we do use natural bait scents and additives offshore, and while these products don't guarantee any level of success, and you're certainly going to catch plenty of fish without them, the added appeal definitely doesn't hurt and often provides that slight advantage that can change everything.